what is up youtube welcome back to another video and this is the minecraft hardcore series that you guys have all been waiting for you wanted me to continue so here it is but things will be a little different this time instead of doing the 25 day format that i usually did i'm just going to be doing a normal minecraft let's play here and this way i'll be able to get videos out a lot faster because before to make the 25 days it took me a really long time to edit them do the voiceover and add some funny stuff so instead i'm just going to be straight up playing the game and talking at the exact same time so i don't have to do voiceover you might hear my keyboard a little bit but it shouldn't be that bad because i do have like oh, an office type keyboard because my mechanical keyboard before was super loud so there's no way i was going to do a voiceover with that thing so now hopefully the keyboard is a lot quieter and now I will be able to pump out Minecraft contents faster than ever. Let's keep this series, the number one series on my channel. And also just a little note that these videos will still be approximately around 25 days each. Alright, so first things first, let's go check up on the iron farm because I did leave this AFK for about a couple hours before I quit this series. Or I didn't really quit, but I like just kind of took a break from it. And let's just see how much iron we have in here. It's been a while since I've been on this world, probably like two-ish weeks. Okay, it's pretty good. So we have like one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven stacks. Oh, there's an iron golem dying right there. Oh, okay, I gotta be careful about that drop. Yeah, so that's a good amount of iron. Um, I think my goals are just to get some more emeralds because I have a decent amount right now, but I think I need some more because I want to make the beacon out of emeralds and iron. Like, it's not my chest right here. I got a good amount. I have 25 iron. 25 emerald blocks and a tons of those other leftover emeralds so i think we are going to be pretty set on making this beacon right now all right well if the beacon is going to be the first thing that we do today i am just going to go ahead and grab all of our emeralds and all of our iron i am also going to go up to our farm and grab those two um yeah wait hold up i want to actually use my elytra i've never really used my elytra that much oh damn my armor is about to break we're not about to but i should probably get some new armor soon yeah, it feels nice to have an elytra. I haven't used one of these in a while, too. Oh, oh, I probably should make this platform bigger. I almost fell off of it. Yep, we're just gonna grab all of our iron. We can also use these poppies into making like a composter kind of thing. All right, now I just need a place to build this beacon. Um, I kind of want to build like, I want to expand like my base kind of area over this way since there's just so much open space. So I think I might build it around here. I might just do it right here for now. Yeah. And also these chests, if you don't know what they're for, this is just another storage thing that I had because I had barely had any chests in there, so I was kind of overflowing with all like the mining I was doing earlier. So yeah, that's pretty much what those chests are for. Alrighty, I think I found a pretty good spot for where our beacon is going to be. Um, this iron block is where I'm actually going to place the beacon. Yeah. Oh, I just realized I haven't even actually gotten a nether star yet. I still need to do that. I don't know why I'm making the beacon right now. But yeah, I'll be back when I finish up this beacon. I don't really know how big it's going to be right now. Yeah, honestly, I'm starting to run out of iron, and I don't think that I am going to be able to build this thing. I don't have enough resources for this. So the thing I'm going to do is I'm going to leave my iron farm AFK, and I'm also going to go in the nether and grab up some wither skeletons, so then I can actually summon the wither and get the nether star. All right, I just grabbed some diamond leggings from inside the chest, and I'm going to go and disenchant them real quick because i want to get better armor like right now my leggings are all right protection four unbreaking three but that's it we need more than that so i'm gonna see if we can get some good enchantments here unbreaking three protection two unbreaking one. Oh, i kind of want to get that because i feel like it's gonna have other stuff on it but like i'm level 22 right now so i need to get more levels and then i can come back to this all right so i was walking and then they're trying to get to the nether fortress and i came across this thing and it said it was like a bastion remnant or whatever, and I think this is part of the new update and I don't really know much about it, but I'm gonna try to go inside and see what we have here. I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to- oh, that's not good. I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to be wearing- oh, that's a lot of gold. Okay, well, I, while I was saying, I'm pretty sure I have to be wearing gold armor or something like that because the people will like, target you or something. Not really sure. Don't really know much about this place. Um, yeah, I see a lot of- those guys i think they're piglins i'm not really sure uh this place is pretty cool i'm just gonna grab some of their gold if they don't kill me like okay i'm getting scared bro yo is he aiming at me oh shoot chill 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 i don't know what to do bro Bruh. oh 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 no 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 this ain't good this ain't get out okay this place is scary i should probably come with like fire resistance or something <laughs> All right, well, now I'm here at my nether fortress, and I'm just going to be trying to gather up some 
uh, skeleton skulls so we can actually like spawn the wither. This will probably be really annoying without looting to be honest. I might need to go back and get some looting. But that'd be pretty hard. I'm just gonna sit here and grind them out. Dang, there's actually a lot of- oh no, don't- oh, I thought he fell off the edge. There's actually a lot of them for just this small little fortress. Have we gotten any yet? Haven't gotten a single one, that's great. Alright, I think I'm probably done with this nether expedition because I've literally- who hit me, bro? What? You stupid. I've literally been freaking here like killing wilder, wilder skeletons for like an hour. Not, not actually an hour, but it's been- it's been so long and I've got- I've got one head. I think I might actually have one back at base from another time. But yeah, this is taking a really long time without looting to be honest. But I, I'm done for now, man. There's like none left. Killed like all of them pretty much. Alright, now we're back at our little base. And let's see what we got here. Oh wait, no, they're not in there. Yes, wait, I have two. I have two. Okay. Wait, so now we have enough, I think. Alright, sick. Um, I don't even know where to put this blackstone stuff. I think I might just put it out here in these chests. Because... Dude, I really need to make a new base. Like, this this small house just ain't cutting it anymore. I should probably start doing that next episode, maybe? This episode, I just want to try to get the wither down and just try to get a beacon. Because I think that's pretty important for this series. Alright, so, before we go into our wither battle, I just made some strength potions. Um, yeah, strength... Wait, I think if we use gunpowder, do they... Oh, okay, I have two gunpowder left. I'm pretty sure if you use gunpowder, it makes it strength two. I'm not 100% sure. Either that or gunpowder makes it splash. I don't even know. But let's see. Oh, it makes it splash. Oh, wait. Is it redstone that makes it strength two? <laughs> I'm so bad at potions, bro. Alright, hopefully this makes it strength two. Oh, it just increased the time. Are you joking? I don't know how to make this strength too, bro. Someone help me, please. I mean, at least we got three potions for eight minutes. I'm pretty sure one is going to be enough. Now I'm going to go see if I can make some regeneration potions. All right, I built myself a pretty long tunnel down here in the caves. And I think I am ready to fight the Wither Skeleton Dude. Wither. I don't know why I said Wither Skeleton Dude. His name is it's the Wither. Stupid. All right, well, I'm going to put on my strength, my regen. Let's get this started. Boom, boom, bam. Ah, run. I think this is the right way to do it. You pretty much sit, stand in this long pathway and just bow him. This is gonna be a pretty tough battle because I'm not too good at this game. All right, well, this bow is taking off lots of health. Jeez, this is actually pretty crazy. Oh my God, dude, I'm actually, where's well my golden apples at, bro? I forgot about these. Yo, chill, 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 chill. I don't think I needed to eat that, but... Going in for the dub. Come on. Come on. Let's go. There we go. I actually beat him. Where's another star at? Oh, I got it. Yes, sir. Diamonds. Diamond. Ah! No way. Let's go. I just found diamonds in Minecraft. Sick. All right, well, that worked out pretty nicely. All right, now that we're back at home, I can finally craft up our beacon. Alright, so I'm pretty sure we're gonna need some obsidian. I have no idea where that is. Um, oh, 17 in there. Oh yeah, I put 12 obsidian in that chest down there. Because when the wither actually exploded, he exploded a bunch of the obsidian that was nearby. So that was pretty lucky. Um, we're gonna need another star and some glass. I have tons of that in there. Alright, let's craft up our beacon. I wonder if we get a uh, achievement for this. I think this is the right way. Yep, there we go. Beacon, let's go. We do not get an achievement. But I'm sure we're probably going to get an achievement for powering it, I'm guessing. Come on. Let's go. Bring home the beacon. We got a new achievement. So now we have our very own beacon. But I'm going to expand this because this thing is pretty small right now. Um, yeah, this is looking pretty nice. Ow, ow. He didn't fire. Where's my water bucket at? Oh, I don't know. Okay, I'm, I'm bad at this game. I'm sorry. All right. Now that I got my beacon running... I'm running a little bit faster now. You can see I have speed one. And um, I will be making that beacon a lot bigger. So we can hopefully get speed two. And we'll have multiple beacons too. Because the wither is actually a really easy boss to fight. I didn't really re realize that until after I killed him. It's just getting the wither skills and skulls is going to be so bad. It's going to be annoying. So right now I want to plan out what I'm going to be building in this little area. Because the next episode I either want to start building my like mega new base kind of thing. Or we can just start working on new farms. I don't really know. Let me know what you guys want to see in the comments. But I'm just going to be start planning out stuff. Alright, so if that's going to be our beacon, right here I want to be like, this could be like our storage unit area, like right here. 
Um, I don't really know what to build around this. Maybe like a farm. We could have like a industrial area and just have tons of farms in this area. Um, I could build like a really cool looking modern house off the side of this mountain. This looks like a pretty nice place to build something. I've actually never been in here before. Yeah, this looks like a pretty nice place to build something. One last thing, I am gonna go and check out the village because I haven't been to the village in a minute. Oh yeah, and also a freaking, what's it called? A village, village trading hall, we need one of those. So definitely we'll be making a village trading hall over there too. It just transporting all the villagers over is gonna be a pain, but I will figure that out one day. Yeah, we have a lot of villagers in here. What do we got? I forgot. Unbreaking three, efficiency four, it's pretty nice. Also, one of the comments told me to make a gold farm, which I, I am thinking about, and I think I'll make it like later in the future, because those are pretty advanced, and yeah, thanks to you for suggesting me making a gold farm. Our ending villager is still alive, that's pretty nice to see. Oh, this huge sugarcane farm over here, I haven't harvested this in a while. I'm just gonna go harvest this real quick. And that's pretty much it for this episode. I know it seemed like it was a little short, but don't worry. This video literally only took me like a couple days to put out. So hopefully with this routine, I will be able to put out videos a lot faster. If you guys enjoyed this, please just let me know. And if you want me to go back to the 25 day format, I can consider it. But like the only problem is it will take me so long to get a video out. And it's just pure grind. It's kind of annoying. Like I'm just thinking of switching over just to episode formats. And I think it works out well. Well, anyway, I hope you guys have an amazing day and I'll see you guys next time. Shut up.